Welcome back. We have raised the spire in Curieville. And then we kind of got stuck there, so... I guess it's time to move on to a different realm. And I think we're going to go to St. Andrew. Let's see what awaits us there. Keep the missions, they told us. And I believe them. And we did it well, preparing for the arrival. Okay. Um, one place we can go here, St. Andrew Vaults. Let's see, I hope it's at least not as cold as the other place. I mean, I like cold places, but that was a bit ridiculous. is a long time to get there. Travel between dimensions. Or, you know, to load. Okay. Definitely not as cold. Looks nice. Big structure here. Not quite tropical, I don't think, but... Uh, Definitely looks nice and warm. And get our fingers to defrost after Curieville. I cannot see an arch. I'm assuming there is one if we have to go to an arch in every place. Might be behind the this structure and this wall. Let's take a look around though. More crates and air canisters. Oh, what's this? Permanent maintenance requisition conservatory. It looks like there's a, uh, yeah. I guess the conservatory is above, and then pod is where we are in the bottom right. And I guess this is the big structure that we're looking at. And then track damaged replacement required. Interesting. And the track crane is the blue line up there, which crane axis is in the top right. Okay. And it looks like if we want to get to the conservatory, we have to go to that socket where the track is damaged. So... We are the keepers. I guess. Well, let's just see what this actually looks like. Lots of tanks over here. And a nice chair to enjoy the view on this side. Which... I don't know. I think I like the view on that side better. Somebody wanted to look this way, though. There is something there. Quite sure what it is from this far away. Alright, um, let's go up here. This almost seems so puzzly, but such is life and learning, problems and solutions. I think I have solved this final problem well. <laughs> I mean, it is a puzzle game, so kind of makes sense, doesn't it? 
Okay, this definitely looks like the thing we were looking at of the diagram. Oh, and I see the broken piece of track over there. It is laying on the rock. I guess needs to be replaced. Wait, did that happen before or after? She put all the keepers to sleep. Because if it happened before, then... Okay, so they requisitioned a rail replacement and then just never did it before whatever happened, happened. And neither did uh, our mentor voice ever deal with it. And if it happened after, she why, why write the requisition form? That's like requisitioning... You write a requisition to yourself if she was doing all the work of the keepers. I don't know. Looks kind of cool, though, with all the bridges above each other. So if that diagram is right, the crane axis should be up there somewhere. Can't really see it. Um, and this... I don't know what this is. You're not gonna let me walk over that. Okay. Sure. Um, my mouse is getting stuck. Couple or uncouple? Couple. Oh, they're like train cars. Can't connect them. That's for this side, I guess, but there's nothing to couple to, so it won't let me. Now we can walk down this way. And there is a... There's a socket there. Other, that I guess is activated by... I guess this must be a pressure plate or something. Other than that, it does not seem to want to let me pass this thing either, so, alright. Volt Skiff. Isn't a skiff a rowboat? Anyway, um... We can lower or raise it. But not right now. I guess the way up is blocked and there doesn't seem to be a way down, so... It's also horizontal drive. Forward and reverse. Forward we go. It was here, in the sea vaults, I first met he came to observe. I heard these stories by then. Oh, I wish you could remember. And yet, I'm glad you did not. Okay. Just keeps being cryptic, doesn't it? Um. That's where we came from. Now by moving this, we can now access this bridge. Inside this structure, which I guess are seed vaults. But we can't go in there. There's only one that's open here. That's that one over there. There's a few others. There's two open on the... Yeah, 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 we know. There's two open on the level above us. And... Um, well, I can't reach... Uh, no, the last one on the top level is definitely open. And I guess so is the... Yeah, so is the one above us. So we need to get to... I think there's hair under my mouse. One moment there. There, that should help. Perils of owning a cat. Um... All right, well, I don't think we can go up yet, because uh, that's still blocked. Let's go forward. And that's not helpful, because we can't go there. 
We can't get off here because, yeah, it just won't let us go that way. And we can't go further forward because there's another car in the way. Can we, like, couple that from here? No, doesn't look like I can reach that. Can I uncouple? No, it won't, it won't let me uncouple that while I'm standing here. Alright, so I guess we have to at least take this one car with us everywhere we go. But we do seem to be clear to go up now. And we found an open door. Alright, what's inside here is the question. Don't think the overgrowth was intended. She said these were seed vaults, so I guess they yeah, stored seeds of plants here. Flowers, maybe edible things. They need to get their food somewhere. This vault's just missing its door entirely. A lot of them are open. I wonder if there are still seeds in the closed ones. Don't seem to be able to try and open them, so. Oh. Oh, I guess these can be removed from their holes. What's the purpose of bringing, of storing all these seeds when you have access to uh, different worlds? And I guess it may not be like the dunny where they can go wherever they want and get whatever they need by just writing it. If they can only go to these three places, then they're stuck with whatever they had, but then where did these seeds come from? Are they from this world? Or from somewhere else? Oh. Oh my. This all is gigantic. And very overgrown. I don't think we're gonna go this way without an axe. Or preferably a chainsaw. Can't really tell what any of this is. It kind of looks like a greenhouse. Very literally, because it's green. But you know what I mean. Assuming we're like measuring humidity and air pressure or something for these places, if it's all plant based. This looks much the same as the other side. Except we can open this door now. I don't think I've really accomplished much. We can go between these two because everything else is blocked. Um, oh, right. Guess we need to couple these so we can walk across. Oh, there's the broken piece track. It's actually fallen down from the above, though. Um, let's go forward. Oh, this one's open, too. Looks like it's much the same. Not a lot of variety. There are stairs back here, too. I can't get to them, though. That's annoying.
And we can open this door, which leads us to the engine, for lack of a better word. And we can't pass here. I guess if we had another, like the, they're below us there, there was another cart to attach to the skiff. So maybe if we had that over here, we could use this to get, no, we couldn't. Because even if we had another cart attached on this side, the only way we can get into that door is if the engine's here. Because if we move over one that way, we can't get there. And the other two doors just connect to each other, so this is again kind of pointless. We'll see, though. Must lead to something at some point. I'm guessing to get to um, that other side there where the broken piece of track is, we're gonna need two things. We're gonna need to fix the broken piece of track Oh, we can't go up. I don't think we can go forward either. No. I'm gonna fix the broken beast track, obviously, but I think we also need to be able to get to the other side of the... Uh, of this thing. Because that seems to be the last part of the track, so there's on the only way we can get off there is, is if we're on the other side. Oh, that's why we can't get up. Okay, well, I guess that means we need to... Yes, that's what I was aiming at. Um, I guess we need to uncouple these and leave this thing behind. Because it's blocking us. Alright. Go up. Um, let's check out... If we have to go forward here... Yeah, that looks like it's an elevator with a socket that we can just barely... S oh, we can actually reach it. Oh. Well, now I can't reach it anymore. We have confirmed it's an elevator and that it works. There is a socket there, presumably to call it. Doesn't look like I can use that from this side, though. But yeah, um, I guess that's our destination. Well, our actual destination is the arch, which we still haven't seen, so... Don't know how to get there, but I'm assuming it's through there, because there doesn't seem to be anywhere else to go. Oh, I see, that's was on the diagram as the the, tra the track cart. It's actually carrying a piece of track on like a crane-like thing, so I'm assuming that's what we need to uh, fix that. Which means we need to get up there. Well, we, have, we found some more open doors, so let's check inside here first. getting a bit repetitive, isn't he? Okay, we found another... Okay, I'm gonna run down here. Can open some more doors, I guess. There's no cart here. It's not very helpful. See, we can also go to this one. Um, okay. What's the point? 
Again, these three just connect to each other. I guess we could use that to get to the other side of the engine. Because at least it's three of them this time. And not just two next to each other. But other than that, still not very useful. Uh, well, we want to get up there, but we also... I want to check the other open door. Just in case that one might actually do something useful. Back up into there. And then we're gonna have to couple these. We just came from there, so that's not useful. And go one further. Now we can go in here. Who knew about the arrival? That the cycle would change. Channel broke the cycle. And more. I guess. What else did he break? Your heart? Did you love him? I don't know. Well, we found the stairs. That's the good news. Bad news is they're going down. That's just kind of the opposite direction of where I want to go. Still, let's check out. Okay. World's most confusing set of elevators. What are sockets here we can use? Oh. Botanical bed lift. Well, that seems to be all the way down anyway. I don't think there's a way to get up there. Without a ladder anyway. Hmm. Not sure what to do with that. Um, let's see. Oh, we can actually go through here and open this door now. cart in front of the engine, so I'm guessing we're gonna need that. It's the only one we have on this side. No, there's one up there too. Never mind. There's two options. Um, but it's gonna depend on, you know, the um, doors, because we need to be able to get on it first before we can couple it, because I don't think we're going to be able to couple it from the wrong side. We can open this. Okay. Well, at least we've made things a little easier on ourselves, I guess, so opening everything we can. Still not much. We are keepers. And this seems to be the top floor, as far as the vaults is concerned. Looks like we can go up without uncoupling, so I don't care. Um, yeah, we have another cart on the front here, but... Uh, I can't couple it. Which makes me question how this was uncoupled and where people went after it was uncoupled. <laughs> because it's at the top floor and therefore not actually reachable. Um, Weird. Um, that's not very useful, though. We can go that way, though. So let's do that. Oh, 
Okay, there's a platform here. Being distracted by a cat. By a goose. Mm hmm. I don't know if that was audible, but that's the sound my cat makes. It doesn't really know how to meow. Uh, <laughs> okay, anyway. Um, this must be the track cart access platform that we saw in the diagram. I guess that's this thing then. And as we could see from below, it is in fact already holding a piece of track, which is a good thing, because I don't think I would be able to lift these on there by myself. I don't think you it doesn't look like this moves sideways. Like I'm assuming what they would do is just, you know, grab the grab the cable, pull it over this way, attach it, and then raise it and it would just kinda swing over. That sounds like it makes the most sense. Again, not something I'm planning on trying by myself, but we don't have to. Um, let's see. Well, we need to get this all the way over to where the broken piece of track is. Oh, and it looks like even with the range extension... Yeah. Can't get quite far enough. Trust me, this puzzle does is a lot uh, is a lot well, not really easier, but uh, quicker I guess to execute with the range extension um, that we already got from Curieville, which I did not have the first time I played it. Nothing else up here from the looks of it, so let's head back down the ladder. And see if we can get that uh, cart in the right spot. You don't need the range extension to do this. Because you have enough range to just, you know, yeah, move the train over and then you can move the cart but it takes a lot more you know goes of switching like moving the train then moving the cart moving the train then moving the cart the Whereas now we could kind of do it in just two goes because I have so much more range. I kind of want to... I want to see what this ends up doing. So let's see if I can get a good look of that. By going down here. I can't still reach this. We'll not let you drive it back anymore once it's in place. Let's lower the hook. There it goes. Installed. And it automatically detaches. Wow, that's easy. Now we just need to find a way to get there, because as I said before, I think we can go all this way, but we can't get off here because Apparently, we can't squeeze through this gap. Um, so, really, the only platform forward that we can reach is that one. Right below us. Because that one, there's no bridge there. It's too high up. So let's hope we can get our cart where we want it to be. No. I 
can't lower. Why not? Oh. What? Yeah, why not? Oh, because there's actually no track there. Alright, have to go further back. Fine, we'll leave this one here again. And lower. Um, now we're, yeah, above that. So I need to go further back. I'm just completely stuck. Um... Couple that one so we can move further back. Then back down to the lowest point. Okay, now we just need to get to the other side. Which um, hopefully we can do through here. Because that's our only option. I'm going to hazard a guess to get that to get back up. I'm going to have to uncouple this one. Actually, I can also uncouple that, so that will make make things even easier. Assuming we can get there. Let's see, this is the bottom right one, which is happily the one that connects to the stairs. And also lets us go all the way around. Nice. That worked out conveniently. Okay, we're on the other side. Couple this, and now we can go from here. Which should allow us to get to the elevator now. It's nice how that thing like turns so you can access it from either side. Also means that you can't access it from further away, no matter how long the range of your thing is. I don't know if you could... Like, if I were to go up with the stairs, that's prob that's probably be too far away anyway. Um... Okay, so we're here. Now we need to go... forward. And we have reached the elevator. Which, uh, we raised earlier. So now I'm gonna have to bring it back down. We are united. Trying to look at the all those bridges from that kind of vantage point in VR made the game have a seizure. In screen mode, it doesn't seem to, to be that bad. Uh, oh, we found the arch. That's where we're going, I guess. It's down here. Again, clearly lacking maintenance here. Because this is where they got the flowers that are in the living quarters in the swan. Presumably among the seeds stored here. And just a nice little sitting area. It'd be really nice. Have some tea. If only we had a kettle somewhere. Some notebooks. It doesn't look like I can look at them. More anatomy books.
But other than that, it's a dead end, so I guess we're going to have to go up the stairs. Hammers and shovels and crates. Don't look like these are emergency rations. Only Curieville gets rations. St. Andrew just gets crates. Ooh. I guess this is the conservatory, according to the... St. Andrew. Oh, before and now. My purpose was here. My solace is here. I guess she was assigned to keep this place, I suppose. And some, they look like chest knights. Just very big. Let's say they look like they like. Either there was something in the middle there, or they can, like, push back against each other. Not quite sure what th that's supposed to be about. But I guess we'll find out what is in this conservatory in the next video.